Let's call for alcohol. Let's call for Peter the Greg. Let's, let's call for the sun that everybody loves. Let's call for spring because guess what? Spring training is just a right around the corner from ending. We are about this the last week of spring training baseball. I've been doing it, but then after after when WC happened, I just kind of just faded away. And then when WC happened, I just started doing WBC more than spring training. So now I'm back. And tomorrow starts stadium series spring for some teams. I know my team starts stadium spring training series games like two. We always do every year. But uh, I got to do predictions for uh, tomorrow's games. Because these games already happen, so I can't really do predictions. But for tomorrow's games, these are like the last week of spring. So get so enjoy all the springtime you have in Florida or Arizona. Enjoy your last games. Because you're going to miss it when it's over. A lot of people love spring than regular season. I don't know why. Because you're close to the action. I get it. That's the only thing. I feel like a beef line on here or something. I do get it. It's all that thing. Right? Close to the action. So here we go. Spring training. We got Nationals, Red Sox. I was just like catching the last couple ends of uh, uh, Mad Dog Russo, and he's talking about the Dodgers, and he's saying that the Dodgers aren't looking so good. He, he said the Dodgers, three games the Dodgers looking great, and he said all this pitching and all this crap that they're, they're going to be like a, a 94 or something. They're going to probably end up in second, third. Be like, oh, people think they're oh, going to be the best team in Hollywood, the best team in California. I don't know. I think the Giants might take it. I think the Giants might take it. We'll talk about that, but that's what Chris, Christopher Russo said. They're going to be like a minus 94, so they're going to be in the 94, so we'll see. Anyways, Nats and Red Sox. Uh, the Red Sox, uh, uh, towards the end, now ESPN is showing two, uh, they actually showed two broadcasts in the spring training games. So what MLB Network did, as they probably know, the ESPN probably calls them, is we're going to broadcast two spring training games. Okay, cool. So they're broadcasting two spring training games on ESPN. They broadcast one, I think, on Monday, then one yesterday. So when they're doing that, they're, they're, MLB Network didn't show any spring training games until like 1 o'clock. So the ESPN was done showing there, so they show like the top 100 plays, or top 100 players, positions, you know, they do like, oh, best 100 top plays in right field, or best 100 top plays in center field, or left field, or first base, second base, every shows up, you know what I mean? So, it's like, yeah, so, and then we'll do that towards the late, and sometimes they used to a Nike, I think the one time they showed a, a Red Sox Night Spring training game. I think it was last, it was like last year. <laughs> At JetBlue Park South, Fenway. Uh, come on, car. So, Anyways, let's talk about the games. Nats, Red Sox. I've both teams have played okay, I guess. Is they really gonna set their starters? I don't think so. I think maybe tomorrow they might just play it. Usually, because I went, I went around this time like towards the last end when we play. We, I went to spring training last year, like towards the end, like right around this time I was around in spring, like this week. It wasn't this week, it was like last week. I was usually around this time I went to spring, like right when the spring training was over. So when the Angels played, yeah, it was probably around this week, because when the Angels played, the, I saw them when the Angels played the Indians, that game ended up in a tie. I saw them the, when the Angels played the Cubs, that ended up in a tie. Both games ended up in a tie against the two teams that made it to the World Series last year. Because I remember, I think I went to this game. Today's Wednesday, no. Yeah, <laughs> I'm going this week. Uh, no, maybe not. I think we left Wednesday when I went. We got when I left, left to come home Wednesday, so it might have been last week. Whatever, but it was around this time. And, and so then, uh, yeah, it's pretty fun. <coughs> you never get a chance. If you ever get a chance to go to spring training, do so. Beg your parents. I know the games don't count. Please beg your parents. You're gonna have a blast. Even th I know the games don't count, but. It's it's fun. It's pretty much fun. I don't care if it's just rookies players. It's fun to watch and it's enjoyable. And I love 
spring, but I love regular season. I love all baseball. It doesn't matter if it's it could if, if they could play on the street. I'll watch them on the vibe. You know what I mean? guys are like, oh, you still feel sick? No, I actually feel a lot better now. I do, but some people might it's my nose a little bit. But that's that's basically how I'm done with my sickness. So, Nets, Red Sox. I'm gonna go Nets over Red Sox. Uh, I guess Nets uh, looking looking pretty decent as I would have seen so far. Catched a couple of games on MLB Network <laughs> when they when they showed it. They're looking pretty decent. The Red Sox had decent spring after they lost a couple of their players to go to WC. So they seem like they come players to go to WC, but some haven't. So they have they've given the right track. So when WBC happened, I just stopped watching spring training. I've been watching this period WBC. And just my mind is zoned out and no spring training. And then, you know, so just finally getting back to at the WC one ended like last week or something like that. A week or so ago. So, yeah. It was like last week or something. WBC ended. So, uh. So, um, yeah, I'm going to add some Red Sox. We got Tigers, Orioles. We were just really, really just right on the corner, just winding everything up. So, I'm going to go Orioles. Orioles are in a decent spring, you know. Man, Machado's back. All, all some of the players that were in, like, Schwope, Swoops, Swoops, or something like that, whatever his name is. He played for the Ned, Ned come on. He played for the Netherlands. The, the Swoops brothers, Swoops, whatever his name is. They both play for the team Netherlands. Netherlands. So, uh, and uh, so did Machado. Machado played for the uh, Dominican. If you guys can see Adam Jones, Rob Machado, go back, go to MLB Network, go to MLB.com, or go wherever, YouTube, and look up the Rob, because that was, that was awesome. That was a beauty. That was. I don't know what to say, but that was a BD sent from Heaven from Earth, so. <laughs> Anyways. Okay, this is it. Okay, what did I leave off? Okay, Orioles. Okay, now we're Yankees, Phillies. This is another one. The Yankees beat them. I don't remember which one I watched. But they're playing the Phillies. The Yankees r rally back with a base hit to walk it off. One of the young prospects, I'm pretty sure it was. And they have the young prospect. And what a play. And what a play. So. Some medical guy, some medical guy, some guys who has a wheelchair. I'm going to go to the Yankees again. The Yankees are rallied back with they did that one time I saw. I think it was like a couple weeks ago. Like, but they. Like a couple of days after uh, it was over. I, mean, I was trying to catch up with spring. After the WC was over, I'm like, I gotta get back in the spring. But uh, Yankees, Phillies. I'm gonna go Yankees, man. If they could do the rally back, that'd be sweet. That would be sweet. Twins, Rays. I'll go Rays. I'll go Rays. I mean, now now we're all in. Actually, forget about that. Scratch that. Twins. I don't care. The twins are gonna suck so bad anyway. So the rain. No, I'm gonna twins. Let's see. So we have a. So now we're gonna head to. So I guess we have a no. Oh. So I guess Houston's down in Florida. So we have. Unless it's in Houston, unless Houston can in Arizona. One of the two, but we have Rockies Padres, which that. Which is going to be a toss up here. I want to go Rockies. But Padres have been have looking pretty decent as well. So, with the Padres, I guess. I think. Rockies, Padres. Pa Rockies. Now we have Cubs Astros. So let's just an Astros uh, Minute Park because a lot of teams, like I said, my team plays tomorrow at their at their regular stadium, Angels Baseball Stadium in Anaheim against the Dodgers. Then we go then we go if it's Thursday, then we go Thursday up to uh, LA to play the Dodgers at at the um, Dodger Stadium. So 
that's that one. Let's see where I left off. Cubs, Houston, Indians, D backs. Yeah, so I guess, yeah, because it's tomorrow. I'm talking about tomorrow, so. so tomorrow start the stadium games. Some people might stay in Florida, some people might stay in Arizona, but some people might go to their regular stadiums and do it. So, so let's, uh, Cubs Astros, Cubs over Astros. It's going to probably be Astros Minute Maid Park. Cubs in, comes D back. So, is that D back stadium, or it could be, or if not D back stadium, it could be at D backs, um, Spring Trade Ballpark, Salt River Field. And Dodgers Angels at Angel Stadium. Sorry about that. <laughs> uh, Angel Stadium, of course. Angel Stadium, Angels, of course. So, uh, Athletics, Giants. If it's in Glendale, then it's be a Giants game. If it's at Giants game, it'll be San Francisco. I think, it's, I think it might be at San Francisco, if I'm not, if I'm not mistaken. Giants. Good job, it's been, we just killed, I think it was just like 14 or 3. Yeah, I think we just like killed, killed the crap. The crap out of the open days. Like 14 to 3 or something like that. So, anyway, that's it. One of my prediction picks. Um, I don't know. Those are my picks. If you like them, you like them. If you don't, you don't. So, anyways, thank you for oh shit. Thank you for watching the video. Double like it if you're gonna do it. Let me you guys think. Spring training is ending this week. Then come, was it Sunday? Come Sunday. We got opening night to come Monday. We got opening day, so stay tuned. I'll do my picks for that coming out this weekend. It'll be all cluttered up because of WrestleMania week. Because WrestleMania is this week, and I want to watch all the events. I just got the network with my YouTube money, so I was going to say, uh, yeah. So, um, yeah. It's this week. Are you guys excited? Let me know. Who's your favorite MLB team in the comment section down below? You can tell by now. I love the Angels. Come on. It's a no-brainer. Let me know. I'm very excited for opening day. And if you're going to opening day or if your team plays opening night, let me know in the comments section down below. Are you excited for opening night? Are you excited for opening day? Are you excited for both? Are you just excited that baseball's already in full swing? Because it's spring already? All right, let me know. No, you're going to get sung by the bees. Come on, there's bees, girl. She's like climbing on all these bees. They're gonna come after me or somebody else. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. I got, got some stuff to do. Probably do another video later on today. I'm gonna do my final four stuff, so I'll probably be tomorrow. If not, I'll do a couple today because the games are on Saturday. So I want to get all my MLB stuff out today as well, or this week. So I do some picks for for Thursday games, and all of a sudden I'll just do my opening day because. That's it, because they're probably going to have it. They're not going to play all the way up till Saturday. No, I'm assuming. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you all later. Go Angels, since baseball is back. Regular season, this Sunday, April 2nd. Sunday, April 3rd. Put your hats on and use the hashtag. I'm going to be saying caps on for opening night and week a day. And week. Use all that. You could be playing on TV or something. So use caps on. Hashtag caps on. I'm going to do that. Hashtag caps on. I'll probably do that on uh, Monday. If not Sunday, but I'll be watching Mania. So Mania will probably end really late. So hashtag caps on. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, favorite. Catch y'all on the next one. Go Angels.